How to set up taxes in Loi vs POS There are two types of taxes that can be applied to items at Loi vs POS, added to the price and included in the price. Added to the price tax is a sales tax, where all the prices are listed without the sales tax, but during checkout, the sales tax is added to the price, and the customer pays the price of the item plus the sales tax. Included in the price tax is a value-added tax, VAT, also known as goods and services tax, GST, in some countries, where the tax is already included in the price listed. Configuring Taxes in the Back Office To configure taxes, you need first to sign into the back office. After signing in, go to Settings. Then go to Taxes. Press the Add Tax button. Fill up the name field. Then input the tax rate. Specify whether the tax should be included in the price or if it will be added to the price at the counter. Select the items to which this tax should apply to new or existing items or both. Press the Save button. Now taxes are configured, they will be applied for items during each purchase. There is a taxes section on the items card with all taxes that were added previously at the settings. Here you can specify taxes that will be applied during the sale. Applying taxes depending on the dining options. In some countries, the tax on certain goods depends on the dining options. Please be sure that the dining options is activated in the back office. Navigate to the settings menu, features section, and switch the dining options slider on. Go to the taxes section in the settings in the back office. Open the existing tax to edit or create a new one. Switch on the tax application depends on dining option. Click on the select button to choose the dining option for which the tax exemption applies. For example, if you want your tax to apply only for dine-in, select all other options, take out and delivery. Don't forget to save your settings by clicking done. Click on the select button to choose items not subject to tax. You can select the whole category or specific items that are excluded from tax. Don't forget to save your settings by clicking done. Repeat the same procedure for other dining options by setting an exemption for each and choosing items not subject to tax. After you have set the exceptions for your tax application, you will see their short description. You can edit them or save changes. If you have several stores, you can select the availability of the tax for each store. You will also see the information about the applied dining option in the item edit card. During a sale, the system removes the tax from items in the ticket to which it should not be applied according to the settings and exceptions made for the dining option so that the cashier does not need to remove it manually. Note, the cashier can also change the tax's application to the item manually during the sale, but this change would be applied only to the items in the current ticket. Taxes in Reports Go to the Reports menu and select the Taxes section. You can see the list of the applied taxes during your past sales. Enjoy working with Loi vs POS.